Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4 Part 175. In this segment, I'm going to be driving the Pontiac Gate. G8, I know, but uh, I don't want to call it the Gate. So, let's just uh, go and fucking have us a grand old adventure for the Pontiac Production Showcase, limited to just Pontiacs, so. Davis and Taylor are also driving gates, and then we have a couple goats, and then solstices, and Trans Am. I should have went with the solstice and upgraded it. Oh well. I already chose the gate, so I'm sticking with the gate. So, yeah, the Pontiac Commodore. So, uh, let's get started with our first race at Laguna Seca. Alrighty, here we go. Around the Typhoon Lagoon. In my Holden G8, I mean, uh, Pontiac Monaro, I mean, fuck. Or Pontiac Monaro, Pontiac Commodore. Oh shit, how you doing, Miller? What is up? Please give me room, son. Oh, not off to a very good start. I'm just pushing Miller, fuck this. Solstice is uh, a little more nimble than the gate. Surprise, surprise. I really like the Pontiac Solstice. It looks cool. It's again, kind of feel like I should have went with that, but oh well. It will. God, you did the Sakuba 9R in GT5. Hooray! You did a thing. Oh, hello wall. How are you doing? Don't mind me, just hitting walls in a straight line. Alright. Oh, diving underneath Williams. to help. Try to get Taylor here. Gave me room, thankfully. And now we've chased down Davis. Only eight tenths behind him. Three tenths, or two tenths. Not quite three tenths. Okay. So I can go and be passing them down the hill. Somewhere, not sure where. Maybe into turn nine, if I feel like it, which I do. Oh, tight line screwed me over though. There we go. Around the outside. Got him. And with that, race one goes to me. Very nice. Alrighty. So, one down, three to go. More Pontiac Adventures! Yay! Okay, race two at Sunset Peninsula with a twist! We're doing the full circuit, finally. It's been 
of fucking time. So, two laps around, full Sunset Peninsula. Oh boy. So, just be careful on this kink. Hello, how are you to do to do to do? It's getting brown getting my fucking way. Taylor getting shuffled back. I'm just boxed in here. I, I can't do shit. Oh, whoops. Well, Taylor's not having a good day. Thanks in part to me. I should pretty much thanks entirely to me, because I'm the one who, uh... You know, kind of pushed uh, Brown underneath him into turn one. Or, not turn one, turn two. That kink is turn one. And then the sh chicane shenanigans. That dragon trail track like looks legit, like really cool. Q. Looks like I really bought the line track. Probably because they took bits and pieces from real tracks. Place the Grand Valley 300k. Okay, now you're just speaking blasphemy. Also, something just fell on my roof. That sure wasn't sound. So, I'm catching Davis might be an issue here. I kind of faffed around a little too much on lap one. Necessary upshift. Dragon Trail is the best track in beta. But what about, like, you know, not Pocono, not Daytona USA track? Fucking hybrid. Thing. Turn and left, bro. No. Davis. I don't have uh, much time or many more opportunities to catch him and also go for an overtake. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hi Davis, what's up? Triangle track is alright. It looks neat. I mean, it's literally just, hey, what if Pocono was slightly shorter and also high banked? Once again, reminding me of the, uh, you know, the oval from Daytona, USA. Because <clears throat> they're both really similar in shape. So that was a nice pass on Davis. That just kind of happened. Flicked my way past him. And I win the race. Very nice. Very, very nice. Oh wow, Jones finished fifth. Instead of last, which he's used to. And Taylor finished seventh. Nice. Because of the, you know, first lap shenanigans. Whoops. Alright, two to go. And back to the club circuits, but it's okay, because it's my favorite club circuit, and it's also, you know, the only club circuit that I prefer over the full circuit, so... Sedona! Three laps! Yay! Nah, that's all I got. Gotta crank it up, bro, as we head into turn one. Oh, wait, that's not my shtick. Ah, uh -huh, Taylor! Why did you park it at the apex? I mean, I know you were trying to not hit Davis, but still, ah. Uh, this is going well. This is going very well. I love getting boxed in.
Really? Only break damage. Like, no no body damage, no no arrow damage, just just right front breaks a little, a little fucked. From all that. Excuse me. Okay, now I have some front end damage. I would work my way around Taylor, that'd be awesome. Without, you know, crashing everywhere. Maybe do my, uh, exit chicane pass, which means I gotta sandbag the entry. Oh, he recognized my existence, okay. I got two laps to close this, uh, 1.8 second gap on Davis. Breaking a little early, just to be safe. Nope, not paying attention. Going into the grass. Help me. Help my Jesus. Dive bomb. That actually worked out okay. I'm actually very surprised that he didn't do the crossover on me. like 100% expecting it. So now... One lap to go. It's a Sedona. And I already have a two-second lead. Nice. It's gained so much time through that fucking chicane, it's ridiculous. I like the Top Gear fucking billboards just plastered everywhere around here. Specifically the Top Gear ones, oh god. Clear it's advertisements for Top Gear USA. I forget when that show, like, debuted. Was it like 23rd? No, it wasn't 2013. Was it 23rd? I don't fucking know. If it was around 2011, it would make sense. No fucking clue. Anyway, that doesn't matter. What matters is I'm going to win the race. And I'm going to power slide victory. Oh god. Overcorrected it. I'm going to crash across the line. Ooh! Well, um... Rip Williams... Rip cameraman. Cameraman's having all kinds of issues. There we go. Okay, well that happened. <laughs> Oops. Trying to do my best Terry Labonte impression, except I didn't have anybody to assist me. Then Williams comes and dies. Anyways, one race to go. Okay, final race at Sonoma. The NASCAR circuit, naturally. Three laps. Probably gonna win by a lot, because it's Sonoma. So here we go. Ah. There's no way I was making it into the middle there. I was at, I was just gonna ram into the back of Brown, had I not just did that. It's fine, I can get around him right here. Turn three move, it's always available. Always available. Also, oops to Williams. 
as if I didn't do enough damage to him at the end of the Sedona race. <clears throat> Just adding insult to injury now. Cat demands attention, oh no. Too bad I'm on a twisty track. Oh, Taylor going wide. Taylor is all over the place, man. Yep, this is a bad spot to overtake, though. That has not really stopped me before, but hey. Alright, just dive underneath Taylor. Yep. I got a, didn't get a good exit, but he's going to park the car here. Since there's someone underneath him. Yep, there he goes. And then we swoosh around Davis. And now we pull away. For two laps. I wish I could push that on star button in the car on the mirror. On star, what do you need help with? Yeah, um, um this race is fucking easy. You're like, make my opponents less shit. Oh god. Is OnStar even still like a thing? Maybe it's because I don't like watch TV, therefore I don't know, I've never seen any, like, like, car ads for quite a while. But is OnStar still, like, a thing? I don't know. Okay, one lap to go. Pontiac Cup thing. I know that's not what it's called, it's Pontiac Showcase. Pontiac Production Showcase, excuse me. Ooh, big slide up and over the crest. Star is still a thing. Cool. That mystery solved. Anyways. Still wish NASCAR would go back to running around the carousel here. Oh well. Can't remember if someone like told me why they stopped doing it. In 90, I think it was 98 they stopped doing it, because NASCAR 98, which was the 97 season, had the carousel, and then NASCAR 99 didn't. I don't fucking know. Oh well, I win. Easy win. It's an easy race. Around not a very easy track. Eight seconds. I was four seconds a lap faster than Davis. Nice. So let's get my last winnings from the series. We're gonna get to level nine. Yay! There we go. Sweet. I wish NASCAR run the boot at the Glen. So do I. I know they were really contemplating it. I think like during the repave last year, a couple years ago, but they didn't, unfortunately. The boot's cool. But anyways, there's the Pontiac Production Showcase complete. 20 down, 14 to go, and North American fucking manufacturer shit. So, with that, we begin column 3 next time. Stay tuned for more Forza.